This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information for how you can volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Polls by Gerard Manley Hopkins. Read by Linda Liu. Part 1. Early Poems. Poem 1. For a Picture of St. Dorothea. I bear a basket lined with grass. I am so light. I am so fair. Men must wonder as I pass, and at the basket that I bear, where in a newly drawn green litter, sweet flowers I carry, sweets for bitter. Lilies I show you, lilies none, none in Caesar's gardens blow, and a quince in hand, not one is set upon your bows below, not set because their buds not spring, spring not, cause world is wintering. But these were found in the east and south, where winter is a clime forgot, the dewdrop on the larkspur's mouth, oh should it then be quenched not, in starry water meads they drew, these drops, which be they, stars or dew. Had she a quince in hand, yet gaze, rather it is a sizing moon. Lo, linked heavens with milky ways, that was her larkspur row. So soon, sphered so fast, sweet soul, we see, nor fruit, nor flowers, nor Dorothy. Poem 2 Heaven, haven, a nun takes the veil. I have desire to go where springs not fail, to fields where flies no sharp and sided hail, and a few lilies blow. And I have asked to be where no storms come, where the green swell is in the havens dumb and out of the swing of the sea. Poem 3 The Habit of Perfection Elected silence, sing to me, and beat upon my whirled ear. Pipe me to pastures still and be music that I care to hear. Shape nothing lips, be lovely dumb. It is a shut, the curfew sent. From there where all surrenders come, which only makes you eloquent. Be shelled eyes with double dark, and find the uncreated light. This rock and reel which you remark, coils, keeps and teases simple sight. Palate, the hutch of tasty lust, desire not to be rinsed with wine. The can must be so sweet, the crust, so fresh that come and fast divine. Nostrils, your careless breath that spend upon the stir and deep of pride, what relish shall the censer send along the sanctuary side? O oh, feel of primrose hands, O oh, feet that want the yield of plushy sward, but you shall walk the golden street, and you unhoused and house a lord. In poverty be thou the bride, now the marriage feast begun, and lily color clothes provide, your spouse not labored at, nor spun. End of Early Poems Poems, 1876-1889 to Poem 4. The Wreck of the Deutschland to the happy memory of five Franciscan nuns, exiles by the Falk laws, drowned between midnight and morning of December 7th, 1875. Part the First One Thou mastering me, God, giver of breath and bread, world strand, sway of the sea, Lord of living and dead, Thou hast bound bones and veins in me, fastened me flesh, 
and after it, almost unmade, what with dread, thy doing, and thus thou touch me afresh, over again I feel thy finger, and find thee. 2. I did say yes, O oh, it lightning and lashed rod, thou heardest me truer than tongue confess, thy terror, O Christ, O God, thou knowest the walls, altar, and hour, and night, the swoon of a heart, that the sweep and the hurl of thee trod, hard down with a whore of height, and the midriff, a strain with leaning of, laced with fire of stress. 3. The frown of his face before me, the hurdle of hell behind, where, where was a, where was a place? I whirled out wings at spell, and fled with a fling of the heart to the heart of the host, my heart, but you were dove-winged, I can tell. Carrier witted, I am bold to boast, to flash from the flame to the flame then, tower from the grace to the grace. 4. I am soft sift, in an hour-glass, at the wall, fast, but mind with emotion, adrift, and it crowds and it combs to the fall. I steady as a water in a well, to a poise, to a pain, but roped with, always, all the way down from the tall fells or flanks of the vole, a vein of the gospel proffer, a pressure, a principle, Christ's gift. 5. I kiss my hand to the stars, lovely asunder, starlight, wafting him out of it, and glow, glory and thunder, Kiss my hand to the dappled with dams and west, Since, though he is under the world's splendor and wonder, His mystery must be in stress, stress, For I greet him the days I meet him, And bless when I understand. 6. Not out of his bliss springs a stress felt, nor first from heaven, and few know this, swings the stroke dealt, stroke and distress that stars and storms deliver, that guilt is hushed by, hearts are flushed by and melt, but it rides time like riding a river, and here the faithful waver, the faithless fable and miss. 7. It dates from day of his going to Galilee, warm laid grave of a womb life gray, manger, maiden's knee, the dense and the driven passion in frightful sweat, thence the discharge of it, there it's swelling to be, though felt before Though in high flood yet, what none would have known of it, only the heart being hard at bay. 8. Is out with it. Oh, we lash with the best or worst word last. How a lush kept, plush cat slow will, mal to flesh burst, gush, flush the man. The being with it, sour or sweet, brim, in a flash, fool, hither then, last or first, to hero of Calvary, Christ's feet, never ask if meaning it, wanting it, warned of it, men go. 9. Be adored among men, God. Three numbered form, ring thy rebel, 
dog din den man's malice with wrecking and storm beyond saying sweet past telling of tongue thou art lightning in love i found it a winter and warm father and fondler of heart thou hast wrung hast thy dark descending and most art merciful then ten with an anvil ding and with fire in him forge thy will or rather rather than stealing a spring through him melt him but master him still whether at once as once at a crash pall or as austin a lingering out sweet skill make mercy in all of us out of us all mastery but be adored but be adored king part the second eleven some find me a sword some the flange and the rail flame fang or flood goes death on drum and storms bugle his fame but we dream we are rooted in earth dust flesh falls within sight of us we though our flower the same wave with the meadow forget that there must the sour skies cringe and the blear share come twelve on saturday sailed from bremen american outward bound take settler and seamen tell men with woman two hundred souls in the round o oh, father not under thy feathers nor ever as guessing the goal was a shoal of a fourth the doom to be drowned yet did the dark side of the bay of thy blessing not vault them the million of rounds of thy mercy not reeve even them in thirteen into the snows she sweeps hurling the haven behind the Deutschland on Sunday, and so the sky keeps, for the infinite air is unkind, and the sea flint flake, black backed in the regular blow, sitting east northeast, in cursed quarter the wind, wiry and white fury, and whirlwind swivel its snow, spins to the widow making, unchilding unfathering deeps fourteen she drove in the dark to leeward she struck not a reef or a rock but the combs of a smother of sand night drew her dead to the kentish knock and she beat the bank down with her bows and the ride of her keel the breakers rolled on her beam with ruinous shock and canvas and compass the whorl and the wheel idle forever to waft her or wind her with these she endured fifteen hope had grown gray hairs hope had mourning on trenched with tears carved with cares hope was twelve hours gone and frightful a nightfall folded rueful a day nor rescue only rocket and light ship shone and lives at last were washing away to the shrouds they took they shook in the hurling and horrible airs sixteen one stirred from the rigging to save the wild womankind below with a rope's end round the man handy and brave he was pitched to his death at a blow for all his dread knot breast and braids of though they could tell him for hours dandled the to and fro through the cobbled foam fleece what could he do with the burl of the fountains of air Bach 
and the flood of the wave. 17. They fought with God's cold, and they could not, and fell to the deck, crushed them, or water, and drowned them, or rolled with a sea romp over the rack. Night roared with a heartbreak, hearing a heartbroke rabble, the woman's wailing, the crying of child without check, till a lioness arose, breasting the babel, a prophetess towered in the tumult, a virginal tongue told. 18. Ah, touched in your bower of bone are you, turned for an exquisite smart have you, make words break for me here all alone do you, Mother of being in me, heart. O oh, unteachably after evil, but uttering truth, Why tears is it, tears, such a melting, a madrigal start, Never eldering revel and river of youth, What can it be, this glee, the good you have there of your own? 19. Sister, a sister calling a master, her master and mine, in the inboard seas run swirling and hauling, the rash smart sloggering brine blinds her, but she that weather sees one thing, one has one fetch in her, she rears herself to divine ears, and the call of the tall nun to the men in the tops and the tackle rode over the storms brawling. 20. She was first of a five and came of a coifed sisterhood. O oh, Deutschland, double a desperate name, a world wide of its good, but Gertrude, Lily, and Luther are two of a town. Cries Lily, and beast of the waste wood. From life's dawn it is drawn down, Able as Cain's brother, And breasts they have sunk the same. 21. Loathed for a love men knew in them, Banned by the land of their birth, Rhine refused them, Thames would ruin them, Sir, snow, river, and earth gnashed. But thou art above, thou orient of light. Thy unchanceling poising palms were weighing the worth, thou martyr master. In thy sight, storm flakes were scroll leaved flowers, lily showers. Sweet heaven was a strew in them. 22. Five, the finding and sake in cipher of suffering Christ. Mark, the mark is of man's make, and the word of it, sacrificed. But he scores it in scarlet himself on his own bespoken, before time taken, dearest prized and priced, stigma, signal, sinkfoil token for lettering of the lamb's fleece, ruddying of the rose flake. 23. Joy fall to thee, Father Francis, drawn to the life that died, with the gnarls of the nails in thee, niche of the lance, his love-scape crucified, and seal of the seraph arrival, and these thy daughters, and five livid, and leavid, favor and pride, are sisterly sealed in wild waters, to bathe in his fall gold mercies, to breathe in his all fire glances. 24. Away in the lovable west, on a pastoral forehead of Wales, I was under a roof here, I was at rest, and they the prey of the gales, she to the black about air, 
to the breaker, the thickly falling flakes, to the throng that catches and quails, was calling, O oh Christ, Christ, come quickly. The cross to her, she calls Christ to her, Christians her wild worst best. 25. The Majesty, what did she mean? Breathe, arch, and original breath. Is it love in her of the being as her lover had been? Breathe, body of lovely death. They were else minded then. Altogether, the men woke thee with a We are perishing in the weather of a Nesseret. Or is it that she cried for the crown then, the keener to come out the comfort for feeling the combating keen? 26. For how to hearts cheering, the down dug, ground hugged gray, hope resolved, the jay blue heavens appearing, of pied and peeled may, blue beating in hoary glow height. Or night, still higher, with bell fire and the moth soft Milky Way. What by your measure is a heaven of desire? The treasure never eyesight got, nor was ever guessed what for the hearing. Twenty seven. No, but it was not these, the jading and jar of the cart, time's tasking. It is fathers in asking for ease of the sodden with its sorrowing heart, not danger, electrical horror. Then further it finds the appealing of the passion is tender in prayer apart. Other, I gather, in measure her mind's burden in winds burly and beat of indragonate seas. 28. But how shall I make me room here? Reach me a fancy, come faster. Strike you the side of it, look at it loom there. Thing that she, there then, the master, Ipsy, the only one. Christ, King, Head. He was to cure the extremity where he had cast her. Do, deal, lord it with living and dead. Let him ride her pride in his triumph. Dispatch, and have done with his doom there. 29. Ah, there was a heart right. There was single eye. Read the unshapable shock night, and knew the who and the why, wording it how but by him that present and past. Heaven and earth are word of, worded by, the Simon Peter of a soul, to the blast tarpian fast, but a blown beacon of light. 30. Jesu, heart's light. Jesu, maid sun. What was the feast followed the night? Thou hadst glory of this nun. Feast of the one woman without stain. For so conceive it, so to conceive thee is done. But here was heart throw, birth of a brain, word that heard and kept thee, and uttered thee outright. Thirty one. Well, she has thee for the pain, for the patience, but pity of the rest of them. Heart, go and bleed at a bitterer vein for the comfortless unconfessed of them, no not uncomforted, lovely felicitious providence, finger of a tender of, 
Oh, of a feathery delicacy, The breast of the maiden could obey so, Be a bell to ring of it, And startle the poor sheep back, Is a shipwreck then a harvest, Does tempest carry the grain for thee? 32. I admire thee, master of the tides, Of the your flood, of the year's fall, the recurb and the recovery of the gulf sides, the girth of it and the wharf of it and the wall, staunching, quenching ocean of emotionable mind, ground of being and granite of it, past all, grasp God, throned behind, death with a sovereignty that heeds but hides, bodes but abides. 33. With a mercy that outrides the all of water, an ark for the listener, for the linger with a love glides lower than death and the dark, a vein for the visiting of the past prayer, pent in prison, the last breath, penitent spirits, the uttermost mark, our passion plunged, giant risen, the Christ of the Father compassionate, fetched in the storm of his strides. 34. Now burn, newborn to the world, doubled natured name, the heaven flung, heart flesh. Maiden furled, miracle in Mary of flame, mid numbered, he in three of the thunder throne, not a doomsday dazzle in his coming, nor dark as he came, kind, but royally reclaiming his own, a released shower, let flash to the shire, not a lightning of fire hard hurled. 35. Dame at our door, drowned, and among our shoals, remember us in the rose, the heaven haven of the reward, our king back, oh, upon English souls, let him Easter in us, be a day spring to the dimness of us, be a crimson crescented east, more brightening her, rare dear Britain, as his reen rolls, pride, robes, prince, hero of us, high priest, our hearts, charities, hearths, fire, our thoughts, chivalries, Throngs, Lord. End of part one. This recording is in the public domain.